All right, everyone. Uh, welcome back to the Lodestar 2. And as you can see, there are some hostiles out there. We are on an Altair 2, responding to a hail from a private Mahoney who needed our help. Uh, we're essentially passing time until Barrett's service. And uh, just going to collect some artifacts, I get to Altair, and all of a sudden, our presence is required. So Andresia and I are going to pay these boys a visit. And spacers decide they want to get up on us. Let's move up Andresia. Oh, we don't even have any grenades on the board. Hold up. Two shrapnel grenades. All right. Let's try out what this new power we got. We have detect star stuff, which allows us to sort of see what we're going. All right. So way down there. Looks like Vasco is also helping. It might. Help to get the old hunting rifle out, let's say. Yes, indeed. It seems the enemy has vanished. Uh, Vasco, I wouldn't exactly call that vanishing, my man. Are you prepared to die? Well, I think they're doing a pretty good job. Andresia, you might want to be wearing some armor or something. Oh, peekaboo! Oh, I got you. Nice. Yeah, nice to see the ye old hunting rifle is still, uh doing a good job for us here. All right, now it looks like Vasco is moving on up, so we will assist. They're too chicken to come out and face us. So let's move up. It looks like Mahoney is also in this direction as well. Well, Vasco, all you need to do is look to your right, my man. Peekaboo! All right, looks like outside is now clear. Right, front door, here we come. Looks like we'll be in a little bit close quarters. Got to grab some of that stuff. And, uh, yeah, we don't need any of these rifles. Calibrated pacifier might be nice, but let's stick to the eel pistol for now. And in we go. All right, so far so good. Anything in the eel lockers while we're here? Doesn't look as such, unfortunately. Uh, to keep our corners covered. Yeah, it looks like spacers sort of take this place over. Grab that med pack. Scientist of the month. Yeah, nothing here in the side office. Andresia, on your game if you please. All right, so it looks like Mahoney may be downstairs. We also have an upstairs. Let's go ahead and clear the upstairs if we can. You see Marines are here. Now, it sounded like Mahoney was part of the Freestar Collective, so if Marines are here, that would be interesting. All right, digi-pick next to a broken door. Take all the digi-picks we can. All right, security key card, only U309, shlamwamma ding dong. All right, in we go to research lab number one, I suppose. Nice and honey to unlock the door for us. Hi! Alright, so someone else is in the AO. Who else wants some? Uh, I already got it, Andresia. I appreciate your enthusiasm, though. Yeah, lots of 50 cal rounds. Peekaboo. Alright, so those look like maybe scientists. Oh, that must be Mahoney there. And those must be the enemies out looking for us. Alright, Mahoney. All is clear. Ugh. Thank God. I figured if I talked myself hoarse on the comms, the cavalry would come. Cavalry is I here. I was expecting some free star militia, but any port in a storm, I guess. Yep, glad I got to you in time. You and me both. Before spacers broke into the outpost, I was relaying orders for Lieutenant Torres. Torres ain't bad as far as COs go, but we'd have been flat out murdered if it weren't for the, and I can't believe I'm saying this, the UC Marines. Uh -huh, Aha, I so, thought so. And this is important. You see a Marine, don't shoot. They're friendlies. Now that is something I was not expecting to hear. Yeah, anyone willing to fight spacers is good in my book. 
No arguments here. So first things first. The makeshift infirmary isn't gonna hold. They set up on the ground floor in the security section. The whole place is on lockdown, so you'll have to find a way there. Talk to, um, uh, Lazama. He's the only thing between them and... Well, you get the picture. Sure. Sounds like I came in the nick of time. Here's hoping it's not just me still standing. Be safe. Be bold. A dead soldier ain't no help to no one. Yep, copy that. All right, clear out the spacers and talk to Lizama. First of all, let's clear the bathroom. Just make sure no one else is hiding out where they should not be. All right. Okay. You know, <clears throat> you couldn't pay me to be a janitor for uh, instances just like that. Oh, even worse, but have some money on the toilet. Not going to say no to dirty money. Indeed, are you a Marine? Hey, Marine. No, you're a space ray. Well, come on around. Andresia, heads up. You'll rule the day you cross me. Oh, hello, spacer. Trying to go around the long way. Didn't work out well for you. All right, rest of the laboratory. Server room. Looks clear. Don't know if we'll find... I'll tell you a lot of people pooping back here. Either that or this was, I don't know, a Halloween gone wrong? Why all the toilet paper behind the servers? All right, 75 bucks, crap. All right, onward and upward. Well, that's a wall. That's a hall. Side door, though. All right, just some storage. We'll take those as well. Unfortunately, no computer consoles to you know, turn on some turrets, turn on some robots, make our life easier, eh? Yeah, that was an earth-shattering kaboom. Yeah, we might have to switch to the rifle on this one. Oh, peekaboo, I see you. It, I yep, time to get back to it. Nothing to see here. Where? Where the hell are you? One over here. Follow the sound of the gunfire. Yeah, let's, uh, go rifle. Go ahead and clear them on through. Hello? Who's next? You next? Yep. Come on around. I got like a thousand bolts with your name on it. Frag out. All right, some money, shotgun shells. Oh, nice, a frag grenade. We needed to uh, get another grenade. Well, looking through the window, one one scientist still alive and an unarmed... Oh, he is armed. Don't point that at me, my man. Are you who I'm looking for, it. Corporal? Well, you think she's a spacer? She's the one that cleared him out. Indeed. Corporal Lizama, UC Marines, medic. We thought we were done for. Yeah, it certainly looks that way. I'm... I'm... Uh -huh. And meet the esteemed doctor, Musa, right? It's his party we're crashing. Yep, Private Mahoney sent me. Mahoney's a machine. She's wasted on this rock. And this... Uh, what the heck are you guys doing here anyway? Doctor. Doctor. Yes. I mean, yes. Astrobiology. We study non-Terran life forms in the settled systems. We uh, seek to understand the various flora and fauna and search for practical uses. A noble approach. Noble mission. We're trying to show that science can advance the quality of human life, not just further our destructive capabilities. Listen, we can't waste time. The Freestar CO, Lieutenant Torres, he locked down the complex. I'm not sure how long he can keep his troops safe. Last I saw Torres was on the third floor, near my office. Take this key and get to Torres. It should open everything except the security doors. And I've get got digi picks for that. Men are wiped out. Good luck. All right, Doctor. I will do my best. The rest of the infirmary looks to be holding well. 
Grab that med pack. And on around the corner. Did they have anything of value? Yep, shotgun shells. Oh, hello, stairs. All right, key card. Up we go. One shot, one kill. You got lucky. There we go, come on out. Right into my line of fire. All right, Crimson Fleet weapon, ahoy. Look, I don't know what you're shooting at, but I'm over here. Give up already. That's what I'm saying. Do the gap. Got you. Oh, nice. There was supposed to be an earth shattering kaboom. I tell you, you can tell we're in free star territory. I'm finding pound for pound more shotgun shells than anything around here. 27 caliber. All right. Oh, Here we go. got him on the right. All right, so we got the spacer's attention. Open that door, I dare you. Andresia, one coming out the door. I got your back. Good one. Woo! All right, let's move up one more in the lab. I assume. 300 bucks. One moment. We gotta leave! Now! Yeah, you do. Alright, head of research. Alright, you two like cool? Someone's been taking out the spaces. Yeah, that's me. I I don't believe it. These damn spaces. Too many of them. Oh no, not really. Are they all gone? Thanks to the stranger, every last one of them is down. Some fancy work there. Thank you. How many more are there with your unit? You got sniper support or something? Just Andresia. The two of us. Holy shit. The two of you did all of that. <laughs> sniper support. Indeed. <laughs> we have to help Captain Myung. She's behind the barrier door. But she's not Freestar, Lieutenant. Our first priority is our men and our scientists. She came in to save us, Sergeant, but no one else would. I will not leave her out to dry. Yeah, I look forward to meeting this Captain Myung. She's... something else. But, Lieutenant, they're the UC. We can't... Sergeant, I am ordering you to help us save those Marines. But how? We got a security override key. If the Marines are still alive, they'll be by the other entrance. We all work together. We should be able to save them. Or die trying. They are soldiers that need us. Are you... up for it? We could really use your help. Well, I mean, I've come this far. I'll be happy to help. And <sighs> let's do this. Here's the security key. You take point. The captain's down one floor. All right, I'm on point. Andresia, you follow me. And the, uh, <laughs> the lieutenant and the sergeant will be close behind. Nah, I'm not a mine. But we will take 6.5. Oh, look at all this money. Profits. Oh, another Dracula. We'll go ahead and sell that back to Freestar. Dover Beach. Yeah, I think we already found that one. So some books we can drop off back at Aquila City. And, uh, hey, I thought I was on point. Where, where are you two at? Going down the back stairs, of course. I, I know where I'm going. Peek-a-boo. Uh, yeah, we already won, my man. Captain. Oh, crap. I got you. Frag out. Cover, 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 cover. Oh, there's a boom. Oh, spacer, don't clear my line of fire. On your left. There we go. You guys got him? Oh, okay. 
Sorry about that. That's what happens when you don't clear my line of fire. So glad you militia rats finally showed up. Could have used you before Dalton bought. Stand down, Private. What matters is they're here now. And who the well, hell do we have here? Another scientist? Perhaps no. you need to stand down, ma'am. Truthfully, they would still be pinned down if it weren't for them. Well, I'll be. Yeah, there you are. Welcome back to Earth. Huh. You don't got the look of a Marine. Certainly not the militia. Who are you? I'm a constellation. I picked up your distress call. What? The explorers? I didn't know you guys packed such a punch. Well, I Captain do. Myung, you see Marines. Veteran of the Colony Wars, the shield of Pardu Pass. Best damn Marine in the service. <laughs> and that loudmouth is Private Sai. If she wasn't such a hell of a soldier, she'd be polishing latrines for the next decade. You've saved lives here, and that is something I won't forget. The Captain and all her Marines. Oh, we'd all be dead if it weren't for them. You lot may be Freestar, but your ground pounders first. I wasn't about to let you all die ignobly to those rabid spacer bastards. Here, here. And, uh, your title. What happened at Parduke Pass, ma'am? War happened. Parduke Pass is a graveyard now. Lots of good soldiers, both sides, are buried there. Captain Myung held that pass for a week against the best mechs the Freestar could throw at us. When she pulled out, she blew up the whole damn pass. Took out a full mech battalion. Might have saved the entire nearer front. Don't Dang, did you get like a Medal of Honor? Pardu Pass was dirty business all around. Alright, fine to meet you, Captain. You've got spirit. That's what we need right now. We've bought ourselves an old-fashioned stay of execution here. But it won't last long. The bastards are disorganized, undisciplined rabble. But they got spaceships and we don't. That I've got one. keep dropping reinforcements until they greatly outnumber us. Then the cowards will hit us. Hard. Well, I've got a ship. Have you ever heard of the Load Star 2? Which means they won't drop the reinforcements right on top of us anymore. But there's too many of them, and only one of you. No, we need a plan. I have a more immediate problem, Captain. I have troops and civilians in the field. If we don't act, the spaces could take them out. I can't abandon them. Damn it. What sort of leader would you be if you did? Not a very good one. we need every trained soldier to fortify and get the defenses back online. Mahoney said their last transmission indicated they were in trouble. If you could perhaps take your ship to the research camp and clear out any spaces. As I do. I'll take care of it. They went dark not too long ago, so hopefully they are still survivors. Just go quickly and safely. All right, research camp. Sounds good, but first... It takes all these different is it not? Indeed. All right, now that we've got everything picked up, let's head outside. Ooh, the cafeteria. Or at least the, uh, the balcony overlook. You know, this wouldn't be a bad place to eat. I mean, not really much of a view, but serviceable. It'll get the job done. Vasco, I return. Real short trip, though. We're just taking a hop, skip, and jump. So, research camp. So, we're down here, and they're literally on the complete opposite side of the planet, under the cover of night. I mean, that might be advantageous for us. Yeah, Andresia, I don't believe harvesting organic materials is what we're here to do. But we do have an advantageous approach. We might be able to pick some off with our hunting rifle before we get uh, into the thick of things. Let's approach from this right side. We may have the high ground and a little bit of cover. Nice and easy, real respectable like. Peekaboo! There we go. Oh, it'd be nice to get a grenade right in there. Frag out, we'll take a look, see? All right, one down. Keep your head popped up. Andresia, keep me covered while I uh, take these guys out, eh? It's over, spacers. I have the high ground. And of course, our nighttime approach getting spoiled by the big ball of fire in the sky. I tell you, these guys are hopping around like they've just drunk a whole cup of coffee. Oh, Andresia, you got him? 
yeah. We're not gonna be uh, long range anymore, although he is holding back. He ran off behind a tree. Interesting. I mean, he's gotta poke out sometime, right? There we go. Let's go ahead and clean up while we're here. Laser cartridge and 7-7. Seven, seven. Oh, 540 bucks, won't say no to that. Yeah, I don't think the guy behind the tree would have anything. All right, a legendary recon pack. We'll take a look at that. All right, we're coming in. Don't shoot. Oh, you really couldn't be bothered that I'm... Terrible. Well, they're dead now. Too damn many of them. You saved us. Corporal Mahoney radioed you coming, but I didn't know if we could hold out. Not all of us made it. Luckily, they didn't know how to you're use a door, a so hero. you're okay. Yep, thank you, Lieutenant. Torres did that. He's so damn green. But all right. Mahoney said for us to go to grounds. There's a cave nearby we're going to hole up in until this is all over. Don't worry, I'll keep the civvy safe from here. Tell Taurus, thank you. Thank you. Will do, by the way. Do you have anything that I might be able to, uh, acquire while I'm here? And if I had to make a guess, this little excursion to the other side of the planet was just long enough for things to go horribly wrong, but we'll talk to the lieutenant, see what's up, and as a matter of fact, let's grab some meal. All right, Lieutenant, everything's awesome. Mahoney said the research camp is all clear. I, I don't know where we'd be without you. Possibly Most dead. Most likely decomposing in some unmarked grave. Exactly, thank Good you, on Captain. You both for making that mission of mercy a priority. Our job is to protect the civvies and never leave a soldier behind. A noble goal. There ain't much room for honor in this damn business, so we have to hold on to what we can. Captain, you should bring up your plan. I believe it's a good one. The Spacers haven't attacked yet, but they've been shuttling men down beyond the ridge. We cannot let them keep reinforcing, otherwise they'll overwhelm us. So we need to take out their ships. Okay. We sure are a lot of them. Ain't that the truth. But I'll take any one of the heroes here over a dozen of them. Yeah. I concur with the captain. We can't hold out if we don't cut off their manpower. The Spacers have two fighter groups. If you take those out, the enemies will be stranded. So launch that fancy ship of yours and get to work. Oh, some ship-to-ship -ship combat. All right, Altair 5, light seconds away in the system, so we don't need grab drive power. We'll go ahead and put that into our uh, lasers, eat through their shields a bit, and let's get to it. We don't take prisoners. <laughs> well, that's fine. I don't either. Oh, look at you, little itty bitty scarab. Yeah. You, sir. Now, you might be worth taking. Now, let's see if we can use some of these controls, eh? Let's aim for their engines. Yeah. Scarab trying to run away. Let's lock on to him. Get those engines taken care of, shall we? Nice and easy. Real respectable light. There we go. Take out those engines. Really? Okay. Alright, on to Altair 1. Attend the memorial service today. Well, let's, uh... Let's see if we can do that. On a Wait 24 hours to skip the memorial. We're not skipping the memorial, but we just have a little bit left to do here. Oh, Alright, shield to grab drive and down. Let's aim for the engines if we can. Can we get those out? Probably not. Unfortunately. Alright, engines. Let's start with the engines here. Just blast those away. Do some damage. We, we've got a rear facing on them. Come on. 
Break those engines. Ah oh, well, sayonara. Alright, on my way! 